Hi everyone, this is Hassan and welcome back to my channel. I grabbed one of the HP touchpads back in 2011 when HP announced that it would discontinue all devices running webOS. The remaining touchpad stock received substantial price cuts and quickly sold out. What made this tablet unique is the card style multitasking feature in webOS found in older Palm Pre phones and the fact that it's Android ready. You can install Android OS on the touchpad. I have mine dual boot enabled. I have it defaulting to Android KitKat 4.4 instead of webOS. Here are five reasons the HP touchpad had potential. Number one, interface. With a true multitasking card style menu within webOS, it was one of the easiest mobile operating systems to use during its time. Number two, durable. It's indeed a thick tablet, however, it's durable. It has survived being tossed around by my kids. It doesn't feel cheap on your hands either. Number three, battery. Gets a solid five hours worth of battery on Android and a little longer on WebOS. Number four, Beats Audio. It has a solid audio from Beats for studio quality sound. Number five, support. While support from HP is non-existent, there is a thriving developer community support. Check out XDA Developer Forums. I hear it supports the latest version of Android, Pi. I'm considering installing that.